योर क्वेश्चन इज एक्सप्रेस ईच ऑफ द फंक्शन इन द फॉर्म ऑफ ए एक्स प्लस बी होल स्क्वायर प्लस सी वेर ए कॉमा बी एंड सी आर कॉन्स्टेंट एंड हैंड स्टेट द रेंज वॉट दे हैव गिवन सी दिस एफ एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस सिक्स एक्स माइनस इलेवन फॉर एक्स बिलोंग्स टू योर रियल नंबर नाउ वी फर्स्ट वी हैव टू कन्वर्ट दिस इन टू दिस स्टेट दैट इज वॉट दे हैव गिवेन द फॉर्मेट इन दैट वी विल चेंज इट फॉर दैट जस्ट वी विल टेक दिस वैल्यू फ्रॉम हियर टू हियर वॉट वी विल गेट यू कैन सी द इज दिस हियर इट इज पॉजिटिव दैट मीन्स वी विल चेंज इट इन टू ए प्लस बी होल स्क्वायर here we will go for a plus b whole square minus b square that is nothing but your x square plus 6x so here if you just see your a a square this is equal to we can say it's a a square plus b square Plus two ab, and here it is minus b square. You can see b plus and minus gone. It will be a square plus two ab. This is in this form. So now what we can do here? You can take a square is equal to x square. That means a is your x. That means one. A is equal to your x. Next, two ab is nothing but your six x. So we will take two ab. Two ab that is equal to six x. We know that a is x. So it's gone. So what is your b? B is six by two. That is equal to we can say is three. B is three. Now substitute a and b value here. So we will get what x plus three whole square minus b square three square is nine and here it is minus eleven. So now it is what x plus three whole square minus twenty. So now you can see here this is in the same format. Here nothing is that. That means one is there. One is there. So that means a is one, b is three, and c is minus twenty. Now next, what they have told we have to find out the range. Range we have to find out. That means we have to solve this value. How we will solve? First, we will take what this is equal to. Instead of f x, we will take it as y. Y. Now you can see this value. Make it to zero. X plus three is equal to zero. So here it will come what x plus three. Is equal to zero. That means x is nothing but minus three. Hmm? And this value is nothing but your y. So we can say y is minus twenty. Y is minus twenty. Now, if you see, this is your nothing but the coordinates of your minimum point. So we can say it's a minimum point coordinates. They are x and y. Here comes comma minus three comma minus twenty is your minimum point. Comes to your maximum means where it falls. So therefore, what we have to do? Just we will take y is equal to zero. So here comes what. X plus three 
whole square minus 20 that is equal to 0. Bring this minus 20 right side. It will be x plus 3 whole square that is equal to 20. Now factors of 20 are 4 into 5. That means what? 4 into 5. So here what we will do? x plus 3. That is equal to we can say plus minus root under 4 into 5. That is equal to plus minus 2 root 5. Now bring this 3 to this side. So here it will come as x is equal to we can say take plus first. So it will be what? 2 root 5 minus 3. Another time take minus. So here x one more is there that it will be what? Minus 2 root 5 minus 3. These are the two values of your x. Hmm? You got the two values of your x? Yes. Now we will go for your y value. How we will go for your y value? Just substitute this value here or make this as x is 0. Here what we have done? We have made y is 0. Now we will make x as 0. So you can see this. x as 0. So what is your y values? Or substitute these x values here. So you can see here what you will get. y is equal. First we will substitute this. y is equal to x is nothing but 2 root 5 minus 3. plus 3 whole square minus 20 what we will get here you can say we will get what minus 3 plus 3 gone so here it will come what 2 square is 4 and root 5 square is 5 4 into 5 is 20 20 minus 20 that is your y. This is equal to we can say it's 0. Hmm? Next. Now we will take minus. So what we will get y is equal to minus 2 root 5 minus 3 plus 3 whole square minus 20. That is equal to, we can say, minus 3 plus 3 gone. It's gone. So here we can get what? See this? Minus 2 root 5 whole square is nothing but 2 root 5 whole square. Same. So here you will get 20 minus 20. That is equal to 0. Now your two coordinates are what? You can see this is your minimum point. And the two coordinates are 2 root 5 minus 3 comma 0 and minus 2 root 5 minus 3 comma 0. So these are your three points. Now, so we can see these are the three values. Just see where the y value lies. You can see here y is minus 20. Here it is 0. Here it is 0. Therefore your range is what? You can see zeros are positive. And this is minus. That means the value lies above minus 20. Therefore your answer is range is equal to fx should be greater than or equal to minus 20. So this is your range.